Do you know him? He is known as 1. The King of Mathematics 2. The Blind Mathematician 3. The Beethoven of Mathematics He is Leonard Euler, a Swiss mathematician, physicist and one of the founders of Pure Mathematics. He was born in April 15, 1707 in Basel, Switzerland. Euler initiated the follow notations. fx for a function. e for the base of natural logs. i for square root of negative 1. pi for the ratio of circumference and diameter. sigma for summation. Constants named after him. Euler's constant. euler mascheroni constant. euler gompertz constant. Theorem. Euler theorem. Euclid-Euler theorem. Identity. Other contributions. 1. Inventing functions for sine, cosine, and tangent. 2. Discovering the relationships between trigonometric functions and exponential functions. 3. Finding relationships between trigonometric functions and complex numbers. 4. Inventing the calculus of variations in mathematical analysis. 5. Creating an entirely new branch of mathematics, analytic number theory. 6. Developing a method for the numerical integration of ordinary differential equations. 7. First formulating the law of quadratic reciprocity in number theory. 8. Defining a constant that represents the numerical limit on the difference between the harmonic series and natural logarithm. Riddle. I have two letters, but with an infinite value. If your answer is pi, then you're correct. Did you know? Around 250 BC, there was a mathematician who attempted to calculate the value of pi. He was Archimedes, a Greek mathematician, physicist, and inventor. He lived in Syracuse on the island of Sicily. Here are some of his contributions. First to compute the value of pi. According to him, pi lies between 223 over 71 and 22 over 7. 2. He discovered that the volume of a sphere is two-thirds the volume of a cylinder. 3. He is the person behind Archimedes' principle that says a body in a fluid is acted on by an upward force equal to the weight of the fluid that the body displaces. 4. He invented the Archimedes screw, which uses a screw enclosed in a pipe to raise water from one level to another. 5. Proponent of Archimedes' spiral did you know? The man that you are facing is one of the seven wise men of ancient Greece, the first true mathematician, and he believed that Earth floats on water. He is Thales of Miletus who lived during the pre-Socratic era. He is a Greek philosopher, scientist and mathematician. Here are some of his achievements. He was the one who measured the, the exact height of the Great Pyramid of Giza. He was credited as the proponent of the five geometric theorem. Here are the theorems. 1. A circle is bisected by its diameter. 2. Angles at the base of any isosceles triangle are equal. 3. The opposite angles formed by the intersection of two lines are equal. 4. Two triangles are congruent if two angles in a side are equal. 5. Any angle inscribed in a semicircle is a right angle. He also proposed the Thales theorem of interception. This theorem is also known as basic proportionality theorem or side splitter theorem. Did you know that you are facing the father of algebra? He was a Greek mathematician named Diophantus who lived in C210 to C296 AD in Alexandria, Egypt. He wrote, Arithmetica. This book contained the first set of writings about algebra. It also contained hundreds of solved algebraic equations. Diophantus was the first person to use algebraic notation and symbolism. He introduced the idea that math problems like x plus y equals 14 have many solutions. For example, if x is 10, then y is 4. If x is 11, then y is 3. If x is 12, then y is 2. Because of his greatness, he inspired mathematicians like Leonard Euler and Pierre de Fermat. As of 2019, an estimated 9 million people get sick from typhoid and 110,000 people die from it every year. 
Typhus fevers are a group of diseases caused by bacteria that are spread to humans by fleas, lice, and chiggers. Do you believe that the first person who gave the clinical description of typhus fever was a mathematician? He is in the person of Girolamo Cardano. Cardano is an Italian physician, mathematician, and astrologer who lived in 1501 to 1576. Contributions in mathematics. He wrote Ars Magna or the Great Art. This is the cornerstone in the history of algebra. This book contains the solution of the cubic equation and quartic equation. He also wrote Practica Arithmetica ad Mensurandi Singularis or Practice of Mathematics and Individual Measurements. In his book, Liber de Ludo Ali or the book on games of chance, he presented the first systematic computations of probabilities.